Hey guys, this is Cesar Gutierrez with KW Laredo. Today is day 53 of the 75 day challenge. And today we are going to go over referrals using command. Okay, so here on your command main page, you go to the applets and you're going to hover over this side and you're going to use the referrals applet. Okay, so you're going to click on referrals. And let's say you have, um, you know, these are the people that are in my network of referrals and they're from all over, you know, from Florida, California, um, everywhere basically. And let's say I have someone that I want to, a referral I want to send to, let's say Austin. So what I could do here is go into map. Okay, and I can search map and put Austin, Texas. Okay, so then all these agents would come out and you can start searching or filtering, filter, filtering them um, using either production, market centers. Um, you can find the market centers. Uh, you know what, I want to use this market center here okay or um you know and this specific market center has a thousand forty one agents okay so let's say i want to use something else instead of market centers i want to use my network so if i have someone in my network which is hannah i've actually worked with her in austin so i already have her in my uh in my network so whenever i do want to send some business out there more than likely i will send it to her um, you know, as I start building my network, I can start using other people, um, you know, because there is, for example, in Round Rock, um, if I want to get an agent that's closer over here, I can go ahead and do that. Or I can um, use the referral partners option as well. So if you notice here in the referral uh, patterns, sorry, I know I said partners. Um, so you notice that in Laredo, these are all the places that we have sent leads to. So it's pretty cool. Um, you can see that, you know, we've sent to Las Vegas. We've sent um, all the way over here to Seattle. We've sent, you know, uh, to Kansas, Chicago, Atlanta, Florida. So you can actually use this map to kind of gauge yourself um, and you can do a reverse search. So let's say you're in Austin, you can kind of see which agents or you can search which agents have been sending to Laredo and kind of have them in your network so they can potentially send you a uh, business. Okay, so uh, in this case, I am going to use my network and let's say I have a lead or um, a referral for Hannah. What I'm gonna do is click on this and it's gonna pull up the form. Um, so here you basically fill out the form based on what you're gonna be sending. Is it gonna be a buyer, uh, a seller, a tenant, or a landlord, okay? So these options start changing depending on what it is. So let's just say it's a buyer. Um, the referral fee is, okay, how much are you gonna charge them for sending them the client? 25% is a, um, the, the standard, you can go more, or you can go less, whatever you wanna do, um, you can go ahead and put it there. And you have a deadline acceptance, okay? So let's give her, you know, 96 hours to accept or 24 hours or, you know, 48 hours, two days to accept the referral. So price, uh, I know sometimes it's very, very broad. You might not know exactly what they're looking for, but let's say, you know, they're looking anywhere between you know, 300 to 375. And then on the notes, you can add anything that you like, you know, um, if you already know what they're looking for, looking for a one story modern home located in downtown Austin. And any other details that you wanna put, you can put it there on the notes. Okay, uh, the client info, if you already have 
the client in your database, you can go ahead and just look it up here. If not, then create a new contact. Uh, sam sample uh, buyer. Are they pre-qualified, pre-approved? Uh, their current, their address, you don't have to put it. Um, their desired location, this is where you can put Austin. You put their phone number and their email. Sample at buyer.com. And the transaction deadline. So here you can put, you know what, they're looking to buy something between now and the end of April. Okay. So that way when they receive it, they know the urgency between um, or how, how long that they need to, or the, how long they have in order to find a house. All right, so um, this way is a lot easier than sending the form and then sending the W-9 and all that information. You still might need to send some of that information, but just for, uh, for command purposes, uh, this is the easiest way, and you can actually track everything everything through here. Uh, once they accept, you can see where they are because you'll be uh, in the loop of everything because it's done through command. Okay, so once uh, once you send it out and they start working it, um, or once you send it out, um, she's gonna get a notification. So on tomorrow's video, I'm gonna go over what it looks like when you receive that notification and the dashboard for both, okay? So guys, thank you again for watching. Um, again, this is for referrals. We need to start building our referral network with other cities, other states, so you can generate more business. Thank you guys for watching. We will see you tomorrow.